Hello, this is Anagoji here, coming at you with another video, and I was going through Netflix, watching, just binge watching Pacific and Black, and for like watching it for the 16th billion time, and then all of a sudden, came Demon Slayer. Yes. Oh my god. Fucking Demon Slayer. Now, I haven't finished it yet, so I'm not going to get into spoilers, but these are just basically my first impressions on Demon Slayer. It is goddamn good. The fucking animation is phenomenal. I think the sword play, the, the sword fights, well, uh, I don't know how you can describe it. Like, in the first episode, they literally show you a family kick. Well, you know, I'm going to spoil the couple, first couple episodes, so, yeah. But only till like, I think episode 5. I think I stopped, I think I stopped at episode 5 because I was dying of, oh my gosh, it was so good. <laughs> but I have to take a break from it, otherwise I'll lose my mind <laughs> of how good this anime is. Like, what kept me away from this so long? I think this anime came out two years ago, and I never got around to watching it because I was too busy watching like Fairy Tale, Eden Zero, Yashihime, um, Inuyasha, Soul Eater, Sudi Jubi Films, and a bunch of others. But when I watched Demon Slayer, I haven't been that excited for an anime in a long time. I mean by a long time, I mean a long time. I haven't been that excited for an anime since Eden Zero. Since Eden Zero aired. And that was like, what, a couple months ago? And even Yasha Himi, the new anime, the new Inuyasha spinoff. Even though I'm not really big on Nest Gens, like Boto or stuff like that, I'm not really big on Nest Gens and Naruto. Yeah, kind of pulled me out. Not really. Like I made it, I made it all the way to four fifty episode four fifty seven, and then just pulled out because I died of episode madness. But I watched like most of the series. I just never got around to getting back to it. And if I had to watch it again, I don't know if I can just start where that left off, or just start from the beginning, and no fans, I do not want to go through that many episodes. <laughs> but anyway, let's get into Demon Slayer. Demon Slayer is probably magnificent. Probably one of the, uh, to be honest, I don't know, it comes close to stopping my favorite anime, but, no, uh, it comes close. Imagery, yeah, it kind of kind of gives me it's one of the best anime out there I can't say it maybe it does be fairy tale in some way not I'll always be like a fairy tale fan but but Demon Slayer is so freaking good like the first five episodes just don't watch the whole series yet just watch the first five episodes take a break and then go back to watching it because then you'll have a different experience. Because after I'm done with this video, I'm going to go back and watch it. Because this freaking anime is so good. Oh my god. My general opinions are... It's one of the best animes. I don't know why. I'm, I didn't watch this. What kept me away from this? I think, seriously, what kept me away from this? Anyway, I'm gonna end this before it gets long because I really want to watch this anime. It's so goddamn good. Like, and it it acts like it knows the cliches, so it just gets it out of the way in the first five episodes. It knows the cliches, so it just gets the Terminant Fighter, the Terminant Fighter out of the way, so we don't have to deal with that. Because no offense, I'm kind of sick of Terminator Fighters in anime. It's kind of a cliche. Like, it gets that out of the way. And... I'm not going to get too much in spoilers, but 
I will put a spoiler warning in the video on the thumbnail title. But Demon Slayer. I think the reason why I stayed away from Demon Slayer is because it kind of reminded me of Dragon Slayer. I think that's because I thought it would be like Demon Slayer. I mean, Dragon Slayer, right? <laughs> I couldn't help it. Anyway. But Demon Slayer is like really good. I highly recommend it. I'm not sure if I'll appear. I'll have to think about it real quick. I'll probably have to do a poll or something on Twitter saying if I like it more than Fairy Tale. It, it's kind of hard. Because <laughs> Fairy Tale had uh, such an impact on me. Like it changed. It had an impact on me. Like I literally have a fairy tale wallet, fairy tale a happy, two happies, uh, fairy tale blanket, and everything. And I got a Natsu one, and I tried finding everything related to fairy tale, but I couldn't. They were all sold out, so I, so I kind of missed the butts on that. Like every time I try to go look for it, it's all sold out. So yeah. Like I try to find a posable, f like a figure, so I can have a fairy tale figure. But anyway. Anyway. My favorite, I think Demon Slayer. I should probably stop saying Demon Slayer, but anyway, this anime is so good. But let's get into spoilers a little bit. Spoiler warning right here. No tets, no title, just spoiler warning, saying it out loud. The um, it's pretty it help it influence it really influences on Japanese culture a lot. You can tell it influences on Japanese culture a lot. You can just tell by the first five episodes. I shouldn't make yeah, by the first five episodes. I'm only doing like the first five episodes and then I'm gonna continue watching it. But for the first five episodes, it's pretty good. So episode one, I think, I'm trying to remember. It's still fresh in my mind. I watched it today, so yeah. Um, I think, I'm trying to remember. Uh, let me remember. Give me a sec. Try to think. Um, man, I dropped my grade there. Uh, demons. Try to remember. Let's just say a lot of stuff happened in there. Not to give, not to get too in depth in spoilers, but uh, demons. Let's just say a family, literally, got. Okay, I shouldn't do that because I don't know how that's gonna work. So YouTube, please do not take me down for that. Please do not. I shouldn't like do. They got like uh, um, they got well. I'm not showing like footage, so uh, they got uh, they got a, uh, they got them. Um, they're dead. Yeah, that's basically what I can say. I don't know what I can say or what I can't say, but. But uh, the D E A dead. Uh, I don't know if YouTube's gonna do something about that. Miss YouTube, please do not get me. <laughs> and if you got that reference, thumbs up. Anyway, the first episode of Demon Slayer is pretty good. I'm only gonna spoil the first episode because that's, to be honest. <laughs> I think each episode gets like better and better. Like really you can tell with animation quality. Okay, let's okay. Let's get the biggest thing out of the way. The animation award. The freaking animation. The animation is so freaking good. Like I'm confused to think like is this a movie? 
because of how good the animation is. That's how good the freaking animation is. Like, are you sure this is not a movie? It kind of looks like a movie. You know how, like, high-budget anime, like, if it if it goes to the box office, it has, like, a higher budget. So, you would s- oh, think this would be a movie, but it's not. It's an anime. It's, like, a anime show, so... Yeah. <laughs> the animation is so... And, oh my god, it's kind of hard to get used to at first because it's really distracting on how good it is. It's going to get hard to get used to because I'm so distracted by the animation. Just look at this freaking animation in the anime. I wish I could show you a clip. Like, if anybody in the comment section, maybe follow me on, go on Twitter and follow me. And I'll tell you a little bit more about my experience with Demon Slayer. Because, oh boy, that was pretty good. Anyway, Demon Slayer was like one of the freaking gorgeous. The first episode gets me right away. Like, I'm very... When it comes to anime, it's... You gotta get me in like the first episode. If you don't... The first episode. The first episode has to get you attached. That's how trick I am with my anime and with most of the anime I've watched even though some of them are debatable because they're split between the fan bases most of them are pretty good so yeah but I am cool with freaking Demon Slayer because it is so goddamn beautiful it is so good Demon Slayer is like one of the best animes out there. I highly recommend it. It's here we go. The first episode really sets up tone for the rest of the series. It it goes over the top. Like it sets up like you know how you don't have any expectations for Demon Slayer and you just like go in blind. Just went up there. It just like this goes. Okay. This one's up. This goes up there. It's really good, and to be honest, I don't know what I'll do without. I don't know the speaking of anime. I'm gonna have to probably have to stop this video. Will stop this video before I lose my mind because of how good the freaking animation is. There's probably gonna be a part two to this because I'm probably gonna have to put this video on hold because I need to finish the freaking this anime is so good it makes me want to go back and back to it because I've watched the first five episodes and they are so freaking good I'm not gonna I'm gonna leave it there so I don't I'm not gonna get into like I said before I'm not gonna get into spoilers so I'm gonna leave it there anyway this is Anagoji signing off and remember Stay big, Demon Slayer fans.